on your car, on the ground, and in the air. Nowadays, it's almost impossible to avoid oak pollen, especially if you have no choice but to spend some time outdoors every day. She loved to come to the parks uh, seven days a, a week. Many allergy sufferers told us they can't get relief from symptoms this year. So I got, you know, cortisone shots and steroids and try to make, you know, make me better. According to Dr. Thomas Leith, a later than usual cedar season contributed to that. It didn't really get bad until January, early January. Frequently, a lot of people get hit hard by the cedar right around Christmas time. So now dealing with oak when its pollen counts reached nearly 4,000 last week and already near 2,000 this week, Dr. Leith says wearing a mask can help. Most people get annoyed by that and don't, don't uh, wear it enough to, to make a difference. In that case... When you come back inside, do a sinus rinse to flush that pollen out of your nose, maybe take a shower to rinse it out of your hair and kind of lessen that impact. So you can still enjoy spring even if relief may not be in sight. I anticipate this will be a long season and people, people will suffer a little more than they did last year. Eugene Cho, KXAN News.